Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and welcome back to Tinker Hunt 10. Friends, this is a fun scavenger hunt where I've hidden five items somewhere in the little village of Tinkerville, and your job is to find them and add where they are in the comments below. Now, you can add those comments here on the YouTube video. You can also add them on Twitter. You can also add them on Facebook, or you can also add them on Reddit. Lastly, if you're in my classroom, you can add your solution in the Google Classroom comments. And if you give me a correct solution, I will give you a shout out the next week. So let's get cracking. All right, friends, so this is Tinker Hunt 9, and as you can see, HKG Rules gave me a solution. They missed the rocket, but as you can see, I will give you tips as you're trying to solve it. So great job, HKG Rules. And among my students, 6th grader Levi also gave me a correct solution. Great job, both of you. I appreciate your participation. Friends, really quickly, I'm going to bounce back to Tinker Hunt 2. These are two of my favorite types of solutions. They put what we found and where it was, like in the house number and what it was beside, or in one nice long sentence where they told me that as well. That is the coolest way for you to give me a solution. So now that you know how to give a solution, let me show you how to search. When you launch Tinker Hunt 10, this won't be here. These are the five people we're hunting for. If I hit F to fit view, we are looking for a jack-o'-lantern, a rocket, blanky, the celebrating kid, and the unicorn dude. These are all projects I use in class. If you look down below, there are links to all three of those. I'm gonna delete this in a moment when I make this file public and you will be searching for all the small pieces in each of these Tinkercad houses. The way I recommend you do it is find a piece you're interested in, click it, press the letter F and it zooms in and then you can see that part. You can right click and drag your mouse or you can use the view cube to try and see what might be hidden in those spots. If you click home, you can bounce back out and you can just keep zooming around looking for cool things hidden in the village of Tinkerville. They can be inside things. I've put doors on everything. I've hidden things all over the place. So make sure you're very creative as you're searching. It is also acceptable to hide items. You can do that with Control H or you can click on them and just use the light bulb here. If you wanna bring everything back, all you do is hit that item there. Friends, remember you're trying to give me a message, giving me the location of all five people. Of course, if you do give me a correct solution, friends, I will give you a shout out in next week's video. Friends, remember the link to this project will be in the description. You can click it, launch it, and open it almost immediately. If you've never used Tinkercad before, I simply use sign in with Google and boom, you'll be ready to start searching. If you want to see the notes, they are right here. These are the same instructions I've just given you. They're just built into the project if you need to look back at them. Don't forget, if you're given a solution, comments below. You can also reach out on Facebook, Instagram, or Gmail. I am HL Mod Tech on all three of those. You can also give a solution on Reddit, Twitter. And last but not least, if those don't work for you, you can visit the hlmodtech.com website. There is a Tinkercad page with a ton of lessons, and at the very bottom is a built-in messaging tool. You can give me your solution that way as as well. Finally, friends, if you enjoyed the project, please give it a like and hit that share button so even more people can join in. Of course, if you got a solution, add it down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.